Good morning guys, happy Saturday, welcome to Blair's Bootcamp. It's a Saturday so we've got no weights, only body weight, but we do have some equipment. We've got a chair or stool, so make sure you've got that here. Um, please, you know, make sure you've got that set up just for the beginning. We're not going to use it a lot, just a few exercises, so don't worry. The first setup is put your mat down on the side, the right hand side or left hand side, up to you, and the chair stool just handily. There, handily, that's a word, right? Okay, make sure you've got some water, shake the legs out. We're doing hip today, a couple of uh, circuit training, working on our whole body. Let's do it so we can enjoy our weekend. All right, okay, shake those legs out, take a deep breath in. Because we know it's a bank holiday, it's gonna be sunny. I'll we'll have a few drinks. Good, two more. Push that bum back. Feet firmly into the ground. Good. Side stretch. The other side. Try and go a little bit further each time. Good. And a crumb across. There we go. Stay here. Into a flat back. Arm in line with your back and drop down to the right foot. Good. Into the center. Onto the left foot. Into a flat back. Into a side stretch. Good, keep going, come on. Back to the center, roll the shoulders round. One, two, three, and four. Going forward. Four, three, two, one more. And one, good. Take your right hand onto your left side of your head and pull over to the right. Gently, try and pull your shoulder down on the left side. Good, and other direction. Good. Good, and hands behind the head. Good. Clasp your hands together behind your back. Pull those shoulders back. Look up. Pull those shoulders back. Good, grab the left foot, come into that quadricep stretch, knees together, tilt the pelvis forward, stretch out those quads. Come on, squeeze those bums. Feel that stretch. Good. And then. And out, really good, excellent. Keep breathing. One more time. Bring that knee forward, up in front of you. Rotate the ankle round. Out to the left. Good. And down. Uh, other leg. Grab the right. Knees together, squeeze that bum. This right leg's really tight. Shoulders back, find that balance. Shoulders down, feet firmly into the ground. Good, and then. Good, bring that knee forward, excellent, really good. Bring it up, towards your chest, shoulders back, rotate the ankle round. And in the direction. Out to the side. Good, shake the legs out. All right, okay, we're coming to the first exercise. 
what we're going to do. We're going to do, if you remember from Wednesday, if you were here on Wednesday, we're doing our single leg hip thrusters. And we're going to do 10 on each side. Then we're going to do our incline push-ups and then mountain climbers. So stay with me. I'm going to just show you the first exercise. So, first exercise. I'm bringing my shoulders, the top part of my back, onto the side of the chair. My feet are about shoulder width apart. Drop to the ground. And then squeeze up. Now, I want you to try and extend that left leg. You're still going to try and drop the hips. That sensation dropping the hips towards the ground. Keeping your body balanced and squeezing your bum up. Up and down, okay? So it's that same sensation of dropping your bum to the ground, but you've just got one leg. You're going to do 10 on one side, 10 on the other. This is going to be hellish. Then we're going to move over, 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 over move on to the incline push up hands, either side for the incline push ups of the chair. Incline, incline push ups. Ah, oh, it's one of those days. And lower yourself to the chair. And up, squeezing up at the top. And then we're down to the ground for those mountain climbers hands underneath the chest for 30 seconds. We're bringing those knees in. We're gonna do this for three rounds, okay? I told you it's hit, hit on a, hit on a Saturday. Slow down, slow down brain. All right, okay. Get in position, hip thrust, hip thrusters, single leg hip thrusters. Oh, get me a drink. Ready, <laughs> get in position. Shoulders on the chair. Lower in position, squeeze your bum up. Extend the left leg, let's go. One, squeeze your bum at the top. Two, three, four, five more. Switch legs, right leg extended, left foot down, let's go. One. Four. Excuse me, bum at the top. Three more. Two more. One more. Feet down. Rest. Over. Let's go. Really climb push ups. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. One, two, four, five. One more. Good. Down to the ground. You ready, mountain climbers? Three, two, one. Run it out. Some water quickly. We're going again, okay? Come on to that second round. Okay. Try and keep your feet from going too far apart in those hip thrusters. So, if you find yourself struggling to get your balance, bring your feet a little bit closer together. So, you don't have to throw your weight onto all one side. It's centered. Are you ready? Ready. Left leg. Up. Let's go. One. Two. Flex that foot. Three. 
Four. Five more. Four. Three. One more. Good, switch legs. Extend the right. Let's go. One. Two. Three. Four. Three more. Done. Good. Are oh, you feeling the glutes? And the incline push up. Three, two, one. Let's go. And 10. Down to the ground. Uh, come on. 3, 2, 1. Run it out. One round left. Good. Really good. Okay. One round left. Let's do it. Come on. Whew. Think of your form. There's incline push ups that you get yourself as low at the chair as possible. If you're struggling, come to the wall. Decrease the incline. So if you're here, you want to, oh, sorry, increase the incline, I should say. But bring yourself to the wall and lower your chest to the wall. I'd rather you did that than give up on that exercise. Okay, get in position. Are you ready? Feet in position, stay on the left leg. Let's go. One, two, and squeeze. Three. And squeeze. Squeeze. This is five. Six. Seven. One more. Switch legs. Stand the right. Let's go. One. Two, three, four, good, one more, oh yeah, bum down, in the incline push-ups, Oh, well, we'll push ups. Three, two, one. Let's go. Two more. One more. And down. Ooh. Mountain climbers, three, two, one, let's run.
Get those knees up. Come on. Ah. And rest. Oh, good. Okay, grab some water. Big stuff. Gonna move those chairs out of the way, okay? No need for the chairs anymore. Whew. Away. Well, need this towel. <laughs> Next up, timed events. Three exercises, and we're going to do 30 seconds for each exercise. We're going to do a squat knee kick into squat jumps, and then we've got a couple of seconds to get down to the ground. And we do our ski jumps, or sorry, ski abs, I should say. So, tell you what, I don't want to kill ourselves with the abs. Let's do those ski jumps, okay? No, we can do it. We can do the ski abs. I believe in you. Come on, we'll do this. Move this out of the way so we don't kick it over. So, squat, knee, kick. We're gonna start in position. Feet, shoulder width apart. I'm gonna come down in that squat, bring my right knee up, kick of the leg, extend. Now you might feel a bit tight in your hip flexors. If so, just come down for a second, kneel in hip flexor stretch. Just try and get stretch out those hip flexors for those kicks. I'll tell you what, now that I've done it, I realise they were really tight, tight. <laughs> a lot tighter than they needed to be. Good. Move your own body. So do that while I'm going through the rest of these exercises, okay? So do that squat knee kick. Then I meant those squat jumps. Lifting off the ground. Up and landing softly on the toes. Try and go for as many as you can before resting. Because we're going immediately into that. And then we're down to the ground and we're doing those ski abs, okay? So hands underneath the chest. I jump my feet to the right side of my hands. Out, to the left, and out. What you want is for your abs to contract. It's not just think about where your feet are going. Foot placement. You want to be thinking of that as well, but you also want to be thinking, are my abs contracting? Are they pulling my feet? Up. And they pull my knees up, which then in turn brings my feet up. That's what you want to be looking for, okay? I can tell you guys, it's going to be a hard hit. I'll try your best, okay? I'll start my trying mine. Up. Into the squat. Knee kick. I'm going to start low. Are you ready? 30 seconds. 3, 2, 1. Let's go. Squat, knee. That's it. Focus on a point on the horizon. You ready? Squat jump. Let's go. That's it. Oh. Come on. Down the ground. Abs, let's go. Almost there. 
rest. Oh, God, I killed my head flip. My quad's on fire. Oh, yeah, 30 seconds. You ready? Let's go. Come on. Looking for agility here. If you're tired, that's okay. Move a bit slower. The reason I want you to go faster so you push yourself. So you get your heart rate up. So you work harder. Are you ready? Squat jumps. Uh. Uh. Come on. Two, three. Ah! Uh. Done. You ready? Ski abs. Three, two, one. Let's go. Rest. Almost there. Come on. One more. Squat jumps. Let's go. Eight. Oh. Oh. Come on. Come on. Last ten seconds. Shot. Let's take a rest. Let's take a minute. Okay. Next up. Some more resting. <laughs> Before we go into our ab circuits, okay? Because that's how quick we're moving here. I have enough time. Oh, it's not even 10 o'clock. So, breath back we're gonna do four kick sets and a four push-ups and we're gonna do it for a minute we're gonna rest for a minute and do it again again rest for a minute and do it again okay this is the final thing before we go into our abs but I want you to try and move quickly 
through these processes. So, you know those push ups. So, I'm going to start. This is why I want you to be. So, if you're facing the camera, be here, your mat's in front. Your hands down. We're pushing up. Hands in line with your chest, elbows tucked in. Push up, okay? You're going to do four of those. And then you're going to kick sit. Jump your feet forward. Four. Jump your feet back. And down. It's going to feel like hell. Like all does. <laughs> now, if you struggle with the push ups, kneeling, kneeling push ups, fine. Remember for those kneeling push ups, though, from where my knees are, from where my hands are. My hands aren't in front of my shoulders, they're out of line with my shoulders, they're underneath my chest, and they're outside of my shoulders. My hips are braced, I lower my chest to the ground. I'm not lowering my hips, my hips are braced, I lower that chest. And back up. It is all in the upper body, okay? I need you to brace those hips. Your chest touches the ground before your hips do, okay? That's what we want. Don't want your bum in the air, but I don't want it towards the ground. It's that split the difference, okay? Oh, come on in. We're going to do this for a minute, rest for a minute, and we're going to repeat it three times. First bottle of water done. Oh, not even 10 o'clock. You ready? No. <laughs> Me neither. Okay. We're gonna start with those push-ups, okay? So three, two, one, let's go. One and up. Two. Kick sits. Push-ups. Last time. And rest. Well done. Okay. Rest. Okay. It's a minute rest. Get your breath back. Take your shoulders round. Think of what we did last time. Can you change any of it? Can you do better? Better form? Okay. Get my breathing under control, breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. Okay, you ready? Now for those push ups, if you're struggling, take your hands out slightly, a little bit wider. Elbows are still going to the back of the room. They're not flared up, they're tucked in. Okay, 10 seconds, going back to those push ups. Are you ready? Let's do it. Come on. Three, two, one. Let's go. One. Kick sit. Push ups. Rest. Oh, good. 
Really good. One more time, okay? One more time. And then to abs. Really good. Again, shoulders back. Breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth, keep your shoulders down. Breathe in. Put your hand in your stomach, feel your breathing. You're not lifting those shoulders, your shoulders are down. Shoulders have nothing to do with your lungs. Good. As much air as you can manage. Try and oxygenate as much as you can, here as you can. Okay, last time, let's go. Push-ups. Kick sets. Last time. Come on. And rest. Oh, well done. Oh. Remember how awful those ski jumps were? The ski abs, sorry. Whew. Okay, grab some more. We're into abs. Get your breath back, I need to get my breath back. Okay. Three exercises for you, okay? Get your breath. We are doing our crab toe taps. So I'm going to put my hands, fingers facing towards my toes. Or if you want, it's up to you. If you want to put them at the back. Do what's more comfortable for this position, just for starting off with, okay? Lift your bum off the ground. Tap the toe, straighten the legs. Tap those toes, okay? Try to go as slow as possible. You're shifting your weight slightly. And left hand for balance, right hand for balance, okay? Again, if you keep your knees a little bit closer together, it's easier to control that balance because you, you're taking that central line, that central line for balance, so it's easier for your body to adjust weight-wise. Then, V-crunch, leg raise. So your hands are basically a little bit further out. Fingers definitely facing backwards this time, or slightly out to the sides. Crunch in. Leg raise up. And remember, you are contracting those abs. We're not wanting to engage those, well, we will slightly engage those hip flexors, but we mostly want to work our abs. This is what we're doing, okay? Then, we're into plank twists. And we know these. Low plank twists. Get into that low plank position. Feet slightly apart. And some hips from left to right. I'm shifting my weight across my right to the left. My bum is still in the air, but my hips are still braced, okay? Hips are so braced and I'm shifting the weight, so I'm working those transverse abdominus lines, the side abs and the obliques. The obliques are taking the force and they're having to contract to hold your body in place and that's what we want, okay? So, we're gonna do 50 seconds of each exercise, 10 seconds rest between each, and we're gonna do it three times. 
<laughs> just Sen just screams at the camera this way. Okay. Okay. Crab toe taps. Are we ready? <sighs> yes. Get in position. Three, two, one. Let's go. Contraction to reach. Ooh, just lost my balance there. myself losing my balance, I'm losing my control a lot. Okay, three crunch twist. This should be a bit better. Hopefully, let's go. Oh my goodness. Shoulders back. Keep those knees together. That's it. And rest. Good. Little plank twist. You ready? In position. Three, two, one. Let's go. Not too fast. Steady pace. Halfway. I'm raised. One minute. Oh. Good. One minute rest. Oh. Oh. Come on. We'll do it again. Remember, breathe in deeply. As much air as you can. We want to oxygenate our blood. Deep breaths. Control your heart rate. The more oxygenated blood you can get, the calmer you'll get, the stronger you'll be the next because you're allowing the muscles to get the oxygen. You're allowing your blood vessels to carry that oxygen to every part of your body. Okay. <sighs> you get a biology lesson one. <laughs> okay. Or a very, very less than mediocre one. Okay. Crab toe taps. Are you ready? Let's get in position. Three, two, one. Let's go. I'm going to try and control my balance here as much as possible. Third. Oh, 
One more. And rest. Good. Let's take those rests out. Let's go. Three, two, one, let's go. Almost there. Come on, 15 seconds. Okay, one more round. Switch directions to the sun. Oh, see it's done. Light. Oh, guys, I'm knackered. Absolutely shattered. Came to fatigue, but also this has been hard. It's been hard. And also working. <laughs> Should do. Okay, we're almost done. Almost ready for that stretch and cool down. Deep breaths in. Remember, you try to pull that belly button in when you contract. So you're working the abs. Same with the plank, you need to pull that belly button up towards the sky. So you're working those abs. Okay, grab toe taps, let's go. Come on. Last one. Rest. 
Oh, flip over. Oh, sorry guys, I can barely speak. Oh, just concentrating on getting through these exercises. Come on. Flank twist, hold that belly button up to the sky. Let's go. Almost there. Come on, 10 seconds. And rest. Oh, come on, child's pose. Slip back into the heels. Good. Put your hands to the right. And over to the left. Come into cat stretch, hands around your shoulders, uh, and over your chest, sorry. All fours. Touch your back. And release. Touch. And release. One more time. Actually, one more time now. Really pull that belly button up. Towards the spine. Nice. Good. Oh, come on to your back. Lie on your back. Bring that right leg up towards your right armpit. Take it out a bit. Just open up that pelvic floor. Your pelvic area. Try to get to the side to open up the groin, open up the hip flexor. Good. Back to the centre. We're going to try and straighten that leg. Okay. Try and keep your shoulders on the ground. Grab behind your right thigh. That's it. Straighten the leg. Down, bent leg over to the left. Oh, keep breathing here, guys. Back to the center. Switch leg. Good. Take out. <sighs> Sorry guys, I've, I've, I really thought I was speaking. <laughs> I just thought it was in my own head. Oh, God. I've just hit one shift. And then, I'm going to go for a beer. Whew. Okay. Straighten that left leg out. Hands behind the right leg. <sighs> also, if anyone knows of a reasonably priced yoga mat going, like a good quality one, please let me know, hit me up. So I'm looking for a brand new one. Try and straighten that leg out. That's it. Down. Over to the right. Oh, I don't know if you heard that. That was my back clicking. Keep breathing, good. Come back to the centre. Bring both knees up towards the chest. Roll your lower back into the ground. Another way. Now, I want you to try, put your feet up in the air, knees bent, then grab your toes and hold on. And you can bring your knees down. 
This one's on. Now try and straighten your legs and pull up your hands. off and again you feel the back the back of the legs try and straighten those legs again okay three two one good Put the legs out hands down either side we'll go into that glute bridge squeeze your bum up into the air And uh, one more time, squeeze your bum up, and uh, good, come up, put your feet on this side here, reach towards your toes, you can arch your back here, now when you come at that stretch, pull your belly button up towards your spine, so you've got that extra stretch, so your abs can contract, so you can reach further. Good. And same again, we're going above our toes. Oh. Three, two, one, let's go. Ease off. Good. Roll the shoulders back and forward first. Three and four and back. Three. Really good. Okay. Flip onto your front. Come into that kneel and hip flexor stretch. Right leg forward, left knee on the ground, hands in the inside of your foot. Good. Really good, just enjoy that stretch. So try and squeeze your bum a wee bit so you're pushing your hips towards the ground. Okay, now you're going to try and straighten that back leg. Same again. Straighten both legs, come up, try to straighten those legs as much as you can, back down, turn it out into that deep lunge, so your right foot's at 45 degrees, set into the heel, knees out towards the toe, sit into it. You've got slight lean forward, or you weight slightly forward. <sighs> Enjoy that stretch. I am anyway. Take it to the other side. Use your hands to take yourself across, or use your own body power if you can. Enjoy that stretch. Keep breathing through that stretch. Good. Come up into a kneeling hip flexor. Hands inside of your foot. Hands in line with your heel. Squeeze your bum towards the ground. Good. Excellent. Okay, I'm going to try straighten out that back leg, try and push your heel away, and try to, still squeezing your bum, if you need to take your left foot out a little bit wider that's okay, and 
Okay, straighten both legs, bring your right foot a little bit closer. Come up and lean over the front leg. Come down, back to that deep lunge. Good. Use your hands, bring yourself to the centre, walk your feet in slightly, hang down there. Let your head go, let your arms go. And gently sway from side to side. Walk your feet in a little bit. Roll up. Good. Bring your hands up. Good. Now put your hands both up. Arms up, either side of your ears, shoulders down. Cross the right. Move to the left. Bring your feet a little bit closer, and again. Contract. And again. Five more. Come on. Good. Back up. Two more. I should say two more now. Last one. Hands on the side. Good. Put your hands behind you, pull your shoulders back. Clasp your hands, arch your back, pull your shoulders out. Keep them clasped and press up to the air. And out. Put your hand on the left side of your head, pull over to the right. Good. Other side. Take a second to breathe in through your nose. Again, breathe in. Give me one more time. Breathe in. And well done. Excellent work guys, really good. Happy Saturday. Now you can enjoy your bank holiday. You've worked hard, worked really hard. Okay. Any questions about any, any of the exercises, you know what I am. Any questions about nutrition uh, or, or things you're worried about. I just want to talk, drop me a message. Okay, lots of love guys. Have an amazing weekend. Have a brilliant weekend. Just indulge a little bit. Enjoy yourselves. That's what's the point of it. Okay, I'll see you soon. Bye.